How's it going YouTube? This is Steve with Reshuvenator again. Today we will be cleaning this pair of Hirachis. Pretty beat up as you can see with our two shoe kit right there. Um, the reason I'm using this is it has all three brushes, microfiber towel, and our sneaker laundry system. So um, be sure to subscribe to our channel. If you don't know already, we do a new video every Monday and Thursday. So let's make it happen. All right, so let's open this thing up. Microfiber towel, sole brush, suede brush, and all purpose brush. We got two of those, one of those. Uh, also, when you get this online, Free shipping over $60 at rejuvenator.com, so you don't have to pay shipping on that. Okay, so the other thing we'll be using today is our cleaning bowl. Collapsible, there we go. I'll be right back, I'm gonna go get some water. That's about how much water I'm gonna use in our bowl. A lot of people ask. This is probably a little more than I would normally use, but. So the first thing I'm gonna do is put these shoe trees in here. I'm gonna take them out of the sneaker laundry bag, um, put them in the, the shoe. Today we'll be using our suede brush to start. We will also be using our all-purpose brush. brush as we'll take out the laces that way we can get the dirt on the tongue Obviously, when you're cleaning different materials, you want to be sure to use the proper brush when cleaning so you do not ruin the material. You can usually tell by gently going over the material with the different brushes and if you feel it snag, it's uh, the wrong brush. Okay, now that we've loosened the dirt a little, I'm gonna go on to the all-purpose brush. Now I'm gonna use the sole brush and I'm gonna let the brush do the work. There's no reason to apply too much pressure. Let the brush, you know, bristles do, uh, do all the work for you. The good thing about the two shoe kit, it comes with a microfiber towel, which um, you can actually use to clean, you know, scuffs and, and some dirt marks on soles really well by dipping your finger in the solution and then you apply pressure okay now that that's done the last step in this process really is to put these in the sneaker laundry bag put them in the washing machine so here we have our sneaker laundry bag there. What we're going to do is put this in the washing machine, cold water, um, short cycle, and they should be good to go. Got our Hirachi here. Um, basically, we're going to set the washing machine to a short cycle, I don't know, 10 minutes or so. Cold water, small. Pull it out. amount of detergent all right let's check out these shoes here never 
go. There's the Hirachi. Still a little wet. We'll let that dry for a minute. Welcome back YouTube. As you can see, one clean, one dirty. Um, I'm basically going to lace this one up real quick so we can show you some before and afters. So we'll be right back. Okay, here we go. Before and after, um, there are still some scuff marks. You know, we beat these shoes up. So now they're wearable, you can rock them again um, and not be embarrassed of what's on your feet. So basically we're gonna leave these to you. We're gonna show you some before and afters. If you're not a subscriber to our YouTube channel, subscribe now. We're gonna do a few giveaways coming up pretty soon. You don't wanna miss out. So hit that subscribe button. Until next time, we'll see you later.